So I just saw a, someone text me right now. It's not been long. So I decided to address this issue because I've been seeing it. It's been occurring many times, like multiple times. Um, I've noticed that some people still don't understand what I do. Guys, if I see an opportunity about a job, I will drop the information for you to check. Remember, for you to get a job abroad, like to move abroad via a job, I have said this many times that you have to apply for a job, right? And when you apply, the employer will not accept you. Most times you have to go through an online interview. When they accept you, they are going to give you a job offer. That's the first document you need. Secondly, after you get the offer, the employer is going to ask some details about you. Maybe you want to move with your family, you want to move alone and blah, blah, blah. Then they will not apply for your visa. Most jobs abroad, at least 90%, 90, 92, 95% of jobs abroad, I mean skilled jobs, would apply for your visa. The example is jobs in the Netherlands. If a Dutch company recruits you from abroad, I know people in this country who came through jobs, but you have to be a highly skilled professional. Don't think if you don't have certificates, you can come here and work. It's not possible. Who is going to? Someone was telling me they don't have um, qualifications. So I was like, okay, it's normal not to have qualifications. I advised her to go and try and get advanced level, but it looks like she was reluctant to learn. So my main aim of making this video is to tell you that because I'm tired of people telling me, oh, Milton, I gave this person two million. I gave this person one million to do me a work visa. You were giving the person the millions that have you secured a job. That is my question for you. That is my question. You need to apply for a job, get a job contract. Then they will apply for your visa. Look, most companies abroad would be the one to apply for your visa. There is no Dutch company which is recognized that will employ you without applying for your visa. None. If you go to the immigration website, I mean the IND website, you will see a list of all registered Dutch companies. Any other company which is not on that list, forget about it. It is fake. And only those companies on that list can actually recruit you abroad and do your visa because what? The Dutch immigration or IND actually recognize these companies. I'm tired of seeing people every day coming to me, Milton, uh, what about job visa? Uh, what about this? And again, let me tell you, the competition is so high. You cannot sit in Cameroon and a company is asking people who are qualified cyber securities, like people who are cyber securities experts, right? Or software engineers. Those are the type of jobs you will find online. And again, when you check a job or if you see an offer, look at the description, read what they are saying. You understand? Most of you, they manipulate you and give you certain fake visas. You come here, it is not qualified. There are jobs that are qualified to do a work permit for you, which can carry you for even one to three years. In developed countries, you have to be careful with some of the things you do. Someone was showing me a job on WhatsApp, on WhatsApp for 600000 Someone was telling you, someone is telling you, you will go and pick fruits in Canada for $5,000. It, it doesn't even make sense to you. No, come on. You have to, you have to be smart, guys. You have to be smart. Okay. So get your job offer. If at all, it's going to be very tedious, but again, you can do it. It's going to be very tedious. That's why most of the time I advise people use the academic pathway, get to the country, integrate yourself, maybe by studying. And of course, this way, especially in developed countries, you cannot study in a developed country, have a certificate and you don't work. It's quite not possible. Because they need you, like in the Netherlands, they need people. But what do you have? Do you have the requirements for them to actually put you into their system? That is the truth. So please, my take home message, make sure you apply for jobs. And again, you have to really put in the effort because these things, they are not easy the way you guys read it from Facebook. Yeah, that is a fact. So my last advice, if you cannot move in through school, then you have to understand that you need to be active. You need to be proactive in order to, I know someone who applied for 300 jobs plus, but still didn't get anything. But he finally moved into Europe with a student visa. 
Now, when he finishes his program, it's possible that he can work in any company, especially, remember, when you study in a country, especially in these developed countries, what you studied is where you are going to find a job. You cannot do maybe business administration and later on you are applying for a geology uh, a job. It's not possible. So you have to choose your programs and your battles wisely. I hope this helps you.